<clears throat> okay, I'm recording this very quickly because I have to go to squash. And I have to talk about squash as well. So, for starters, it's the 61st day of the year. Uh, things I'm proud of this week are I used my tax return to pay down debt, and that is very responsible of me. Um, I went for my training run uh, after my months of uh, purely strength training and no running. I did a run. I covered 19.96 kilometers in 90 minutes which is delightful and frustrating as I wrote in my blog because the goal was 20k in 90 minutes and I was so close that I could have gotten there if I had just been a little braver it's not a matter of lacking the capacity it was lacking the math skills at some point in the run when I was calculating splits and everything but I did it and it's fantastic and on the topic of squash Last year, I beat my friend John for the first time. It took two years to beat him once. I beat him once in 2018, and I said my goal was to beat him twice in 2019. And I've already beaten him once. I beat him once in February. So I just got to beat him one more time this year. Uh, the blog is a little bit better. I'm working on just tagging it better and using featured images more and just trying to get it more clickable and accessible because I actually saw how my blog looks on Twitter because I have multiple Twitter accounts now and you know it, it's so easy to scroll past it when it's in its default mode like there's just nothing like I wouldn't click on it either so I know I can improve that and that's what I'm working on um, got a lot of ideas for merch I just gotta find a way to a supplier for workout gear, not just cotton shirts. And the cats exist. So that is everything. That is the news that's fit to print this week.